Hi, I'm here at the uh, negotiations at the executive board of the WHO, but I, I'm talking to Tony Calvin, who's the head of intellectual property and other things, right, for the World uh, what, what exactly is your title at the World Trade Organization? I'm director of the intellectual property division, but as you mentioned, it covers government procurement and competition as well. And why are you here at a meeting about research and development at the WHO? Well, uh, we were uh, asked to, to be available uh, if there's any background that was of interest to delegates taking part in the discussions. We're not really a, a player, we're just a, a resource for, for those who are interested in, in our, our part of the, the overall picture. And what does the uh, WHO think about an agreement that would delink R&D costs from drug prices? Would that be consistent with WTO rules? The, the WTO rule, rules? Well, it's a circular question, I guess. It depends on what the, what the product is, what the approach is. But uh, uh, it's, it's something that the WTO as such doesn't take a position on. It's up to the uh, member states concerned to set the directions. But I guess they would have the flexibility to do that if they... If they wanted to, they could find a way within your rules, probably. Uh, as, as I say, it depends on what the, what the approach they choose uh, is, but there's certainly no fundamental uh, uh, conflict of interest, if you like. Uh, <laughs> well, thank you. Is there anything else you want to add before I let you go? <laughs> uh, well, uh, I think the, the Geneva uh, policy ecosystem working on public health issues is, is moving into a uh, a very interesting, more mature phase where it's less about, uh, you know, the kind of uh, legalistic questions that, that may be in the back of your question, and more about, you know, understanding what are good policy settings and what are the choices that countries have and how best to inform those choices and take those choices within the international framework. And, you know, this, this, this dialogue, this conversation is clearly part of that overall uh, uh, opening up of uh, a very important policy debate. Thank you. Thank you, Tony. Thank you very much.